Well, we want to welcome back the editor and co-owner of 501 Life Magazine, Stephanie Brazil, who is joining us to talk about this month's issue of 501 Life Magazine. Stephanie, thanks for joining us today. Thanks for having me. Of course. Now, I want to talk about a very recognizable face that's on the cover of this month's edition and, of course, also a number of sweet treats. So walk us through this cover. We were really excited and thought it was so nice of Santa to pose for our cover. And yes. he asked me to bring you some of his favorite cookies mm -hmm. and share with some of your friends here at the station uh, in the shape of Arkansas, an iced shortbread cookie, of course with a heart in the middle for mm -hmm. Central Arkansas. Really nice of him to do that. That is so nice. And I, again, I, I, when you brought those in, I was shocked. It, it's so recognizable as Arkansas. Yes. Um, but speaking of Central Arkansas, now these are Santa's favorite cookies, but I know in the magazine there's a whole bunch of other recipes for other cookies as well. We reached out to all of the 11 counties that we serve, and we have a cookie representing each county along with that recipe. So wow. anyone who bakes is going to want this issue. Yeah, if you're looking for that perfect holiday cookie recipe or something to leave out for Santa, then this is definitely something you're going to want to pick up this month. Um, but besides, you know, the Christmas sweets that we're getting, I know there's also Christmas decorations that you're covering, including one particular house that's kind of blowing everyone out of the water. Yes, David Glaze, um, he has decorated eight trees in his home. Wow. And he's the conductor of the Little, uh, Little Rocks River City Men's Chorus. And so every fall, he's so busy getting ready for that with lots of rehearsals. In fact, they have free concerts next week oh, here nice. in Little Rock. But uh, back during the pandemic, he decided, I'm going to pull out all my decorations and put them up, and then I'm going to pare it down. Well, he ended up needing eight trees, and he's wow. decided to just go with it. He also paints an abstract painting to go with each tree and match the colors on it. Wow. So, some beautiful photos in the magazine of, of David's trees. A multi-talented person, of yes. course, who's decorating. So we've covered sweets, we've covered decorations, but of course you also think of kind of like good food during the holiday season, and I know you spoke with a number of bakeries about what they're seeing now. Yes, um, our entertaining feature, Chef Don Bingham went out and visited with three bakeries in particular, uh, Patty Cakes, Julie Sweet Shop, and Blue Barn Bakery for those with dietary restrictions, yes. and said, what is your most popular item that sells throughout the holidays? And they share their secret. So if you want to know what is most popular and you want to have it at your home, you can read that article. And finally, I know that there is a great story about something happening in Clinton as well. Yes, the, the cowboy Clydesdale horses from Clinton are taken to events and parades throughout the year as a donation just to make those events more special. Mm -hmm. And that's happening tomorrow in Van Buren County, yes. Clinton, from about 10 a.m. until dusk. You can go there and have a free ride in a carriage. Uh, pulled by six Clydesdale horses, and wow. we know they're just grand animals. This is a wonderful event, though, because it's a fundraiser that will fill 225 backpacks with food wow. for students every week throughout the school year. So if you go there, it's free carriage rides mm -hmm. by the Clydesdales, but if you buy some refreshments or you shop with the vendors, um, that all helps pack those backpacks. A great event, and you can read all of this, of course, in 501 Life magazine this month. Stephanie, thanks for coming in. Thank you. Merry Christmas to you. Merry Christmas as well. We're going to be right back after this break, dialing for dollars. Don't go anywhere.